Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for December 19th of 2023 is titled NGC 1499, the California Nebula. So what do we see here? Well, let's zoom in a little and take a look and we see what is known as the California Nebula for its shape, perhaps somewhat like the coast of California in the United States. And this is actually an emission nebula. Now an emission nebula occurs when the light from a very hot star emits a lot, emits a lot of ultraviolet light and that light energizes the atoms around that star. And in this case, it's energizing hydrogen atoms. And when hydrogen atoms are excited, what the ultraviolet radiation does, first of all, is to strip the electron off of the hydrogen atom. So that leaves it as just a bare proton. And then the electron and proton will recombine, or I should say the proton will find a, a electron to recombine with. It won't necessarily be the same one. And as it does, it will go through a a different set of energy levels as it can recombines with the a proton. So once it does that, it will go through a different stages and each of those gives off a certain amount of energy and a certain color of light. And in this case in hydrogen, we see that distinct red color that is associated with emission from hydrogen. So if we looked at an uh, a nebula that was made up of something else. So for example, a neon tube, you might see different colors. Or you can do tubes of gas with diff that will give off different colors because each color will give its own distinctive pattern. Now, out in space, we tend to see hydrogen because hydrogen makes up 90% of the elements within the universe. Now, as we said, this resem may resemble the state of California, but it's much, much larger. The nebula is about 100 light years long. So how long is a light year? Well, it's the distance that light travels in one year or about 10 trillion kilometers. So to get an idea of that light goes from the Earth to the sun in about eight and a half minutes and can travel across the solar system in just a few hours. So it takes it's a very a tremendous distance of 100 light years is much further and could travel many times the distance between the sun and the nearest star. So very, very large, obviously much, much larger than California itself. And we see that star, actually, the star that's actually doing all of this is likely that bright star that you see in the image just to the right of the nebula itself. It's a very hot star. You can see it has a bluish tinge to it. And that means it's emitting a lot of ultraviolet light. We will see it as blue, even though it's emitting ultraviolet light, because our eyes are not sensitive to ultraviolet light. But we will then see it as a bluish color, and it will cause the excitation over all those light years, over dozens and dozens of light years. It can extend over that much to really excite all of those gases. So it gives you an idea of the amount of energy being emitted by this star. A star like this will emit many times the amount of energy that our own sun would. So that was our picture of the day for December 19th of 2023. It was titled NGC 1499, the California Nebula. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be ice fog sky. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.